Bitcoins! Today is Friday, July 19th, 2013, at 9.35 p.m. in Madrid, Spain. I'm taking five risks to open my defined benefit pension plan, but I hope to make gains from trade. Here are today's Mad Bits. Bitcoin price is on a bit of an upswing, with a last of 93, a high of 95, and a low of 87. Volume was up as well, to 24,693. Bitcoin's open air trading floor. People gather every Monday evening in New York's Evening Square to buy and sell the cryptocurrency known as Bitcoin. Flashing cash and smartphones, men make trades worth thousands of dollars in the nook of the park they call Satoshi Square. The scene is like an open air trading floor, and indeed, participants liken themselves to the men who hatched New York's first stock exchange under a buttonwood tree in 1792. Similar gatherings have taken place in London, an inaugural one will take place in Toronto next week. Exciting! Open air Bitcoin! And people say Bitcoin never goes outside and is looking so pale. Shh. Winklevoss Twins 20 million Bitcoin fund struggles to find friends. The Twins project has been greeted with lukewarm response amid fears that it would be too difficult for the banks and trading firms to make a profit from such a venture. Bitcoin itself is not even a developed market, let alone to put an ETF on top of it, Reginald Brown, managing director at KCG Holdings, told the Financial Times. Investors have rushed to use around 34,000 ETFs over the last few years in order to invest their money into a diverse range of assets. However, the twins, who claim to own 1% of all Bitcoin, would be the first ETF dealing in Bitcoin. Treasure Shield turns Raspberry Pi into Bitcoin wallets. What? Hardly any of those words I said made sense. The Raspberry Pi is a small computer board. Oh, okay, that makes more sense. Because if they've developed a Raspberry Pi that could hold Bitcoins, then I'd say we should start a bakery. The Trezor is a dongle-sized computer that can be used to hold private keys and sign transactions. The project is still in its early days and its developers have made it open source so that anyone can build their own implementation. Nice work, Trezor. Mad Bitcoin subscription drive update. Mad Bitcoins has one additional subscriber, bringing our total to three subscribers. Thank you for subscribing to Mad Bitcoin. Would you like to join them? Click the subscribe with Bitcoin button at madbitcoins.com. Pay what you want. Subscribe to Mad Bitcoins today. This has been Mad Bitcoins. Mad Bitcoins. Mad Bitcoins.